you need to be an RN and to get into nurse practitioner school, you need to have some experience as an RN and that's important. At the nurse practitioner program that you work at, you don't just teach, you're also involved in admissions. You were telling me earlier, uh, you actually interview quite a lot of the folks that you consider for the NP program. Could you tell me what you look for in a candidate to accept to your NP program? So there's an initial evaluation process where the potential student writes you know, an essay of why they want to go to MP school. Mm -hmm. um, they send in their transcripts. We look at their GPA, of course, and their involvement in the community around us. We get recommendations from their peers and other faculty, um, their previous managers. And we use that as an initial evaluation. Um, out of that group, we interview a select amount of people. And um, we look at that, but then we also ask the student, you know, how do you plan on going to graduate school? How do you plan on balancing work, life, family? We want to make sure they can do it. We want to make sure their, their head's in the right place. We want to make sure they're able to from their grades, but also with their motivation. It's nice to um, see the person, talk to them, meet them. I think that's important and just discuss the program. It's not just uh, asking the potential student you know what they want we also tell them about our program because maybe they're interviewing in other places as well so we want to make sure it's a good fit i think that's the biggest goal make sure it's a good fit make sure they understand what the program's focus is our program is primary care focused mm -hmm. so someone mm -hmm. that wants to go into anesthesia or in the operating room it probably won't be the right fit so uh, we just want to make sure we're all on the same page and uh it, they're going to be successful i think we really want to make sure of that so we talked about NP admissions, what it takes and kind of what you look for. Is there a personality type you think is really ideally suited for an NP career, at least in your program? Um, well, I would probably umbrella the NPs, PAs, the MDs, as far okay. as personality types, because you do need your, you know, group together because you need your clinical skills, you need your didactics. But as far as personality, I think that we all as providers need empathy, you know, and just being sensitive to what the patient's going through, especially our uh, vulnerable populations. Um, yeah. I think that's huge across all healthcare providers, that, that personality, you know, that caring, empathetic personality. Definitely. That's going to be number one, you would say, empathy? Mm -hmm. Absolutely.